another day, another food challenge. Mrs. Biz just paying for some petrol, probably buying herself some chipsticks. I haven't actually told her that I'm, uh, I'm going to New York next week. Yeah, I was just telling the people that I'm going to uh, New York next week. What? Ah, the sprawling concrete utopia of Barnsley. It's been a while. Still can't believe you uh, you bought a car in the year 2020 without <laughs> GPS. Like, what's wrong with you? I think there's some street parking, I'm sure, up here. Mm. There's a space. Yeah, but it's you're gonna have to parallel park, which I know for no, a fact you cannot no, do. <laughs> just wait a minute. <laughs> that was too cocky. Right, let's parallel park. Take two. T yeah, take two. Take twenty-two. <laughs> like a glove. <laughs> well, I mean, people keep asking for longer videos. So if I, uh, if I keep this in the final edit, it should be like a 37 minute long video. Feature length. Ooh, I have to say I'm a little bit embarrassed that I did not realize I have eaten here before. I should, maybe I'm losing my marbles, I'm getting old now. But yeah, we're doing a... What's the challenge called? The backyard, just the backyard burger challenge? Uh, yeah. And uh, nobody's done it yet. Four people have tried. Hopefully oh, I'm going to be the first. So we'll see. Quite appropriate music. <laughs> right, today I'm at a place called The Backyard Barbecue. And I'm saying, is this just called The Backyard Barbecue Burger? Yep. Yeah? You get one second to finish it, no toilet breaks. If you were, if you do manage to finish it, do you get anything? Um, you get a hat that says you completed it. A hat? Yeah. That's, I, I yeah, wear hats a lot. And uh, it's pretty much just a really, really big burger. Which is cool because normally if you do a big burger, it's like st small regular patties just stacked up. This is actually a, a quite a wide, girthy burger. You get um, beef, yeah. bacon in there, cheese, some veggies, coleslaw, and some dirty fries. So yeah, without further ado, it's a bit food. And this, is the backyard burger challenge. Who's gonna? Three. Oh. Ooh, a little ding ding. Ding ding. Go. I should have got like a second second plate really because I'm gonna have to look at all the pickles, man. Look at the heat coming off of it. Ooh, it's still hot. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode, and today I'm at a place called the Backyard Barbecue. As you can no doubt plainly see, doing a rather colossal burger challenge. I'm going to try to do a bread. <laughs> that is mental. <clears throat> Whoa. I'm letting steam up. <laughs> that is bigger than my face. Yeah, but Mrs. Beer's got a tiny little bean head. So it's not that big. <laughs> anyway, this uh, this thing has been attempted apparently four times. It's reasonably new. I think it's only been around a couple of months, uh, but has not yet been defeated. I'm saving all the bacon for like a, a little bacon sandwich at the end. Nice. <laughs> Ooh, smooth tactic. You can still kind of hear Eye of the Tiger playing in the background. Highly appropriate music. Very motivating. But uh, yeah, this thing is um, it's just two giant burger patties, a bunch of bacon, cheese, dirty fries, you know, that kind of stuff. <laughs> you animal, ordering a second portion of chips. No, I didn't have a breakfast. Oh yeah, I did. <laughs> Classic Mrs. Beard. I didn't have breakfast. Oh wait, yeah, I did. This is the most entertaining thing I've ever seen ever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna put some of coleslaw in the bun. I use this tactic in um, that burger video in Canada, I think. Not sure if it's gonna work here, but I'll, I'll try. <laughs> Yeah, this was a, t a strong tactic that I used at uh, the, the Mel's Diner episode in, in Canada recently. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Oh, no, you're <laughs> Always good manners, I find, to apologize to anyone who might be sat directly opposite you <laughs> while you do this kind of thing, especially if it's just, you know, a couple trying to enjoy a, a quiet lunchtime meal. I don't know that there was much point in doing that before going, get my head stuck back into this, but. 
Yeah, probably not. Anyway, you know, the, the most embarrassing thing about this is I did not realize before arriving I have actually done a food challenge here before and I walked in and some of the staff were like, oh, you're back. To which I responded, uh, yeah. <laughs> but apparently they discontinued that one a while back. Maybe I should start keeping track. Like some kind of journal. You know what Randy does? Keep track of how many I win and lose. I wonder what my win ratio would be. Eight and a half minutes in, so. Halfway there. A four? What am I going to do with a four? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Maybe eat with some decorum for a change? I don't know what Mrs. Beard is thinking. When, when do I ever eat with a four? Come on now. My jaw's starting to tire now. I'm going to take off the bacon. I know the coleslaw sandwich. The thing is, the top bun is always less less moist than the bottom bun. Because, it, you know, all the stuff hasn't sunk into it. So this is probably going to take a little bit longer to eat. Oh. I'll put an extra hour on parking. Yeah, come on, you gotta pick it up now. We only put an hour on the parking meter. I don't know. I think it was like max stay one hour. So I, I, I gotta put a rush on here. Oh, the bread is hot now. I think it's because it's brioche, you know? It's putting up some resistance. The mustard is pretty clean too. It's hot, it's hot mustard. Get there, cat of town. Hot mustard? What voodoo is this? Anyway, if you, uh, if you managed to finish this, you, uh, it's a standard pretty much uh, price package. Uh, wall, uh, uh, <laughs> photograph on the wall of fame, free meal, and a free cap, a free trucker's cap. There's a lot of good stuff. Indeed. Fortunately, they are covered in something though. So there is some flavor there to be enjoyed, uh, but I enjoyed this whole meal. Um, I think oftentimes if you do a burger challenge and the patty is larger than, than usual, a lot of the flavor gets lost, but this was not the case here. Uh, I, I really enjoyed it. Right, three minutes. Who said 18 minutes? I did. Well. Close. Not too close, you've got about another 10 minutes worth of food there. Alright, well. The bread was actually really hard to eat. Hey, there we go. Now I'm using a fork. Time to get stuck into these dirty fries, which are pretty much just fries with some uh, melted cheese on top, some bacon and barbecue sauce. When you do a food, any kind of food challenge in a place like this, it's usually just fries. But at least these have something on them, so it tastes good. <laughs> Past 19 now. I didn't realize there's like a sweepstake going on here. People are betting on my time. <laughs> yeah, I did feel kind of bad because somebody said 16 minutes and they look really confident. As long as it's under 30, you'll be all right. Hey, I'm just happy I'm getting it down. It's, it's no joke, man. This is a big bug. Yeah, this, this was not a tea party. No walk in the park. Um, the chef actually he told me at the beginning that um, it includes 2,000 grams of, uh, of fillings, so that's what, 4.4 pounds. Um, the bun weighs 400 grams, so that's almost another pound. And then the fries, probably another. So yeah, you're looking at kind of around six pounds of food. So um, this would be, it's doable, but um, incredibly tough for most people. What was that thing called? The Elvis, somebody get the Elvis waffle at the ready. <laughs> You're insane. <laughs> 23. I'm trying to get everything. Yeah, clean that plate, Sunny Jim, leave no doubt. And I've already actually got a sneak preview of the dessert menu, which is on a blackboard opposite me. So that's coming. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you at the next one. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, oh, look at this. Oh, yeah. A trucker's cap's in fashion. I'll make it work, I reckon. <laughs> <laughs> well, I came to do it adamantly we're going to smash it. He managed a quarter. Next guy, he managed that half. Somebody did a quarter? Yeah, but then I did it. A quarter of the burger, they didn't touch the fries on the door. <laughs> this is my, look at this. Sometimes with dessert, the simpler the better. Waffle, peanut butter, jam. Rummy. Sacrifices had to be made so that them two portions of chips could fit in. You just don't do your trousers. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's my girl, that's my girl. <laughs>